Hello guys and welcome to the yeah, third episode of Insane Aquarium. Uh, oh boy, this is gonna this is gonna be something. So uh, let's see. We're definitely gonna want Wadsworth because yeah, this money. Hmm, what else? Thinking we'll probably also want Rufus. Yeah. So yeah. Um. Oh yeah, I do. I do not like this tank at all. So that's that's something. Uh, you, you'll probably see why I dislike this tank, but oh, it's it's a lot worse than the last one. Like, it gets very very hectic. I hope you guys do enjoy this horrible tank because no, I don't know. I don't enjoy it. That's for sure. pellet for one of these guys and I think we'll have an adult. Oh come on. Not even gonna tell me what kind of enemy is approaching. Well wow. as you can see Wadsworth uh, uh kept our fish safe. And yeah, that's a. <laughs> yep, this is gonna be real fun. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna buy some food upgrades real quick. And then once I get some. Uh, once I get some more adults, then I'll buy a Guppy Cruncher. This tank is going to be horrible because the prices for the egg are just going to get so high. I mean, I can't remember if there's any new aliens with this tank. I know the last one introduced a lot of new aliens, and by a lot I mean I think two. But hey, it also introduced, you know, multiple aliens at one time. So I'm not quite sure what else gets added, if anything does. Okay, so here we go. Guppy Cruncher. Enemy approaching. Well, we need a guppy for this guy to crunch. Crunch. Look at him. He crunched that gumpy. That the guppy. Oh, man. This is gonna be fun. Well, how much is this worth? A lot, kind of. You know, just like what, hundred something, hundred fifty, I think. Yeah, just a bit. I did not mean to buy another guppy cruncher, but hey, I now have another guppy cruncher. You can see why uh, these guppy crunchers aren't exactly the best things to manage because you have to get, <laughs> you have to get the baby guppies down to the bottom of the tank. And also, I was I'm kind of surprised about how little money you actually need to uh, to buy egg pieces on this level. So this doesn't really like. I don't think this tank accurately reflects how absolutely horrible this tank is. Seymour the turtle. Uh, I don't really need that, so I'll stick with the main three, three little pets I got right now. Because, you know, things fall in slower. Eh, I don't know. I think I can manage uh, the coin falling rate how it is. 
man. So, let's see. I honestly, yeah, I can't think of any new aliens. At least in this tank. I don't know. I don't think there are any new aliens. I think it just, hey, here's a bunch of new mechanics that you gotta deal with. Which is horrible. But I could be wrong. It's been a while since I've played on this tank. Ooh, wait, but I do think that we will get a kind of a kind of weird pet soon-ish, I think. But it's it's kind of it changes up the gameplay quite a bit, actually. Yeah, type G, so we're gonna. Oh crap! Oh no! <laughs> Are you serious? I can't tell. Okay, did he crunch it? I don't know. Okay, no, he didn't. But he just spawned right on top of there. Thank God for the whale, because if that whale wasn't there, that guppy would have been gone. I'm telling you what. I did not mean to do that. Guppy cruncher, I cannot buy you. I'm sorry. <laughs> that was kind of a waste of money there, but oh well. I'll get more. <clears throat> so once we buy a guppy cruncher, we can see how expensive the egg pieces are going to be on the stage. So that's going to be fun. I'm hoping it's not a ridiculous amount, but it most likely is because, yeah. Oh yeah, now we, <laughs> now we have beetle munchers. Take a wild guess as to what they eat. I gave you. I gave you a second to think about it. It may be beetles, but who knows? No! Get down here! Oh, that's what I hate. <laughs> that's what I hate about this stupid tank. Oh my god! You get away. <laughs> Man, our freaking our crab helps so much with uh with uh killing that stupid alien. So I'm thinking we need to get some more guppies because this is I don't know, I I just hate I hate this tank with a passion. Like, oh my god, I do not like it whatsoever. I need... Oh man. Man, you know what? Oh man, hmm. I, I don't know. I wish I didn't have to play this to get to the next tank. But we can't always have what we want now, can we? So we're just like, oh hey, look. Crumb. It's like they can only jump about halfway up the screen. Oh, man. And I don't see why these beetle munchers need to be so expensive, because it's not like they're easy to keep alive either, because these guppy crunchers already aren't easy to keep alive. Especially when you have a lot of them, like we're bound to have. Oh god. Come on, get down here. Come on, please. <laughs> Oh, hey, would you look at that? One of my big fish died. Ah, oh, that's so great. I'm glad that happened. I'm really glad that happened. Mmm, boy. Okay, well, uh, let's just keep on getting these scuffies. Hey, look, I still can't buy that, but look at that. Now I might be able to... Let's buy one. Oh, look, the egg pieces are... 5,000, okay, you know, it's alright, I guess. Oh, we got a pearl, how much is that worth? I think 500, I don't know. But yeah, it's, um, let's see. Yeah, 500, okay. Okay, but like, 
I do not like this stage. I will never like this stage. This stage is horrible. Let me just... Why can't you make this guy drop a bunch of those? Are you... What? I swear that guy just turned green. How did he die that fast? This game is rigged, I swear. Why is it only alien type G? No. <laughs> Don't you dare touch my fish. You will die. Don't! Oh my gosh. That was... That was some experience. You know, you might think, hey, why don't you just buy a lot of guppies and avoid this stupid uh, other fish? You see, I could do that. I might do that. Because <laughs> honestly, this is just too much work for this tank. I might, I might just be better off buying a lot of guppies and then just having my, uh, my mermaid just spawn a bunch of money whenever she sings and then just do it that way. That sounds a lot better to me. Because, like, look at that. That's so much money I could get with just regular fish. And also, I just missed that pearl. I love that. Oh, boy. I, I'm, I'm kind of worried about how expensive the, uh, the egg pieces are going to be on the next stage. Because... Alien should go away. I dislike you. You just ate one of my guppy crunchers. <laughs> no. I really do not like this stage. I wish it didn't exist. But it does. Let's see. Is this the man I'm looking for? Yes, but no. This is like starting to get into the territory of, hey, be careful because this man might kill your fish. So I'm saying, so we got shrapnel. He'll be good for making money. Let's see. Meryl's gonna be really good for making money. And since I'm going with the idea that I only want to use guppies, uh, I'm gonna go with, let's see. I'm gonna go with, let's say, I think Wadsworth will be a good investment because once aliens start appearing, since we're mainly only going to be using guppies, we're going to be wanting to buy a lot of guppies. So the only things we'll have to worry about is getting our first guppy cruncher and a uh, beetle muncher. But other than that, I think we'll be good because then we don't have to kill it this year. Look at that. What, 150 per bomb? I don't remember how frequently he drops those, but that's a free 150 whenever he drops that. And then she'll sing, give us a lot of money. So yeah, I think with just guppies, I think I may be able to do this within a timely manner. Mayhaps. But yeah. So let's get one of our guppies to an adult. Here we go. Do not. Okay. So let's get like upgrade our food quality. I think we don't need to upgrade the amount quite yet unless we get. Actually, it's gonna be a lot harder to take down Alien G if we don't have more food quantity. So I'm thinking we might wanna do that. So we have type P. I don't remember what this is. Is this a new one? Oh, it is. I forgot about this one. Yeah, this one is kind of horrible, especially if you don't know the tactics to deal with it, because even though he's staying at the bottom of the tank right now, he won't see that. He's free to go anywhere and go away to 
recognize two short counters, so if you don't want him killing our guppies, uh, you're gonna have to regain a little bit of his health if he goes up here, because there's no predicting when he's gonna go back into rage and he will be killed. But yeah, that's actually one of my like one of my more favorite uh, boss aliens, one of my favorite aliens, because. You get to actually think instead of just spamming on him, because if you just spam on him, you're never gonna kill him. And then you won't be able to feed your fish. And then you just lose. So let's get a guppy cruncher. You know, feed that guy. There we go. And, uh. But like, look at all this money. I'm fairly certain. Buying a lot of guppies is not a bad choice, although it may be a bad choice. Yep, okay, that's that's what happens if you do not catch the bombs. They will just kill your fish. Yeah, I may have bought too many guppies. But hey, now we know. Don't buy that many. Or do. And just be very, very careful about when you eat them, because they will starve. I don't care about this guppy cruncher. Uh, he can die whenever he feels like, because I don't need him, honestly. Because I'm fully able to collect all this money by myself. So I got Type P again, and since we got this many medium fish, watch this. All of them just swooped away. And like this guy, I don't know if I'll be able to show him off, like, yeah, see, he'll go up if he's just stuck him on side, and then he can go off to the side. But you don't want him going and killing all your fish, so you'll have to shoot him a little bit to keep him in one area. Oh, don't touch my guppy cruncher. That'll be sad, I guess. Oh man, he didn't touch him. Okay, whatever. But yeah. Like, let's see. Uh, we can buy one of these. Yeah, 7,500 per egg piece. That's gonna suck. You better throw a beetle right now. Ah. Uh, no, this is why I don't feel too particularly good. You know, he died. I don't like how fast he starves to death. You know what? You can die too. I don't necessarily care for you that much, so, uh, sorry, but bye. <laughs> Guppies is the way to go, in my opinion, because it's a lot less to manage. You just gotta click on a lot of coins, so you don't have to hassle with feeding the Guppy Cruncher and then waiting for the Guppy Cruncher to shoot out a beetle that then feeds the other thing. So you could just get screwed by RNG, especially if you have the jellyfish that just collects things. Although I don't know if he actually just collects beetles, so I may be wrong about that. But yeah, this alien is great for getting weapon upgrades, because you actually need them, unlike when Type G is here. Okay. So, I'm gonna upgrade my food capabilities. Which, are these guys hungry? I don't think so. Considering they did not even attempt to go for the food. But like, look how much money I can be here to collect. I mean, if I had, if I had Stinky the Snail, he'd be having a heyday. Actually, since I'm using only guppies, I think I may just be able to showcase the secret version of guppies that exist in this game that there is absolutely no hint of being able to exist but they exist sure enough i did not mean to buy that but oh well oh 
Okay, that, yeah, did not mean to buy this guy. That was a waste of money. Dang it. Okay. Type P. Okay, here we go again. You stop eating my guppies! I know that's exactly what you do, but you need to stop that. You stay away. No, you stay away from my guppies, man. You get out of here. Get out of here. No, straight. No! No, don't you dare just. Oh my god. Guppies are so stupid. No! <laughs> There's three of my big guppies. Yeah, that, that's why you want to buy some upgrades, because one, guppies are real stupid, and they will just walk directly into the alien. And by walk, I mean swim. Don't tell anybody these guys actually have legs. Don't you dare touch my guppies. You better die right now. Do it. Just, just die. I don't need you terrorizing my tank. I see you wanting to eat those guppies, but let me tell you what. I'm not gonna let you do that. Look at all that money. Yeah, you better starve to death. I'm such a good fisherman. Oh no, our guppy country died. What a horrible, horrible thing to happen. Type P? More like... I don't know. I'm gonna shoot him. Oh yeah, this guy... This guy will not drop bombs if there's an alien here. It's a good thing, I guess. But yeah. Stay away! Why can't... So, the tapping feature does not work in regular gameplay. It only works on the personal tank, which I absolutely hate because it's not even useful there. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and buy some better weapons because honestly, I kind of need them. Because the less time that Alien uh, stays in the tank, the less time he has to wait for guppies to live. Just, just go swim into him. So I'm gonna max out my gun. And the max gun actually is fully automatic. I mean, I love the sound of the constant cash. Well, let's see, let's begin. We have two more weapon upgrades. The one after this, I think, will be the last one. Yeah, okay, I just need 2,000 to get it, but I think I can make quick work of it. I mean, he really uh, does not like being hurt. You stay away from my guppies. I don't care if you're gaining health, I'm going to kill you. Okay. Hopefully, one of my guppies will uh, become the final form of Guppy soon enough, although it might be a little bit longer, for... but once one starts to, you know, actually fully grow up, the rest are soon to follow. I just don't know which ones are close to growing up. Coins, feed my fish. I 
think about two more rounds of feeding and I should start to see some of these guys uh, fully grow up. So we got alien pee here, blah, blah, blah. You know, just, oh no, oh no, that's a bad time. You stay away from my guppies, I swear. I'm going to shoot them. Don't stay away from them. Watch all of these guppies. Come on, just fully grow up. It, it, it'll be real cool. I'll uh, uh, call you cool. It'll happen, I swear. You know, I don't know about uh, this bomb fish because it's just a risk to have him. He doesn't really pay out that much. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna keep him for the next round because. He's just too much of a risk to have in the tank. It's like, look at that. With how often he goes. You could just not be paying attention one time and there goes one of your fish that you spent a lot of time growing. waiting for them to uh, actually grow up. They should be doing it soon, hopefully. I can't quite remember what the next pet is. I have an idea of what it is, but I'm not sure it'll be what it, I think it is. Stop, you stay away from my guppies. They are mine, and I'm growing them up to be big and strong. Now you may be asking, you know, why don't you just suffer with these guppy crunchers and beetle munchers? Today I say, I want guppies, and that's all I have to say. I want a guppies, because they're cool once they finally grow up. It just takes a long time. This, this is to a... Uh, show that good things are worth waiting for, I think. It's what it's supposed to be. Come on, it's gotta happen soon. It's been, what, like 10 minutes on this tank alone? Oh, you... Oh was busy collecting money to notice that he was flesh. You stay away from my guppies. No. Do not go up there. I want to know why he's a fly swatter. I'm not gonna have this bomb fish in my tank ever again. Mm -mm. He is not worth having. Come on, guys, just grow up. I want I want to show everybody that how cool you can be. But right now, you're not being real cool at all. <gasps> there we go. We got our first one. And guess what? They drop diamonds. Go killing my fish when they're so close to all becoming kings. But yeah, 
as you can see, even the King Guppies are affected by the mermaid. But I absolutely love these King Guppies because they're blue and they're real cool. Now I want to get a few more up to uh, King Rank because, you know, they're cool. I want to have a tank full of them. I swear, if you eat my Kingfish. Come on guys, you hungry? You wanna become kings? I think this guy became a king because he was one like one of the guppies I first had. And everyone else is like the ones I bought later. Now I could buy the last egg piece, but I really, I really, really, really want to get a lot of kings. Because I haven't really done it before. I've only really had two at most. So I want to at least go for three. I know it's kind of a big goal, but I, I want to see it happen. So this this will make the episode quite a bit longer because I decided to go with guppies. But hey, I wouldn't really have been able to show you this otherwise because you know it's just it's just one of those things that takes time, but it's cool when you actually do it. Obviously, it's not going to be cool for you because. You know, it just makes the episode a lot longer, but hey, I want to do it, and this is my series, so if you want to see someone else go speedrun this game, you can do that. I'm just taking my sweet time doing what I want to do. It's nice. I don't know why you even keep opening your mouth. It's not like you have anyone to protect. So I think that's probably the last alien we're gonna fight because these guppies ought to be real close to becoming kings by now. Because I think they were only three or four feeding cycles behind this first one. So I think they're just about ready to become kings, if I'm not mistaken, which I probably am, but hey, I, <laughs> I, I know that my money's getting a bit ridiculous, but I really, really want to see this tank just be full of kings. Come on guys, just become greater beings. There we go, they're starting to turn. It's great. I want to see a shower of diamonds in this tank. I don't want to see a single gold coin. I want to see this tank the best it can possibly be. Come on. I know this is really, really prolonging this stage, but it's fun. Come on, just one more. Just one more. Okay, come on guys. Just... Come on. Just one more. I know I'm almost at 30,000 money. But I want to see all the diamonds just fall down. Can you guys really be that stubborn? Okay, whatever. I guess you guys just aren't... You guys aren't cool enough to all become kings like these three have. Well... I'll give you one more, one more chance. Just one. Okay, fine. That was your chance. Now we're done. Oh, yes, this this one. Yes, this one is good. Combo. Oh, I'm in. You know, I'm gonna take a quick break and then come back to this. I think I might 
I might skip showing one of these at one of these. I'll just show getting the eggs because honestly, it's it's been a lot so far. So I'll see you when I purchase these eggs. Okay, just gonna show you. Uh, it says alien signature type you detected. I don't know what kind this is. So uh, let's see. Oh yeah, it's this guy. Yeah, you can uh, you can uh, deflect those things back at him, and uh, yeah, I can kill him with them. So that's a fun mechanic. Anyway, uh, yeah, I'll just skip ahead to when I get some egg pieces. Okay, and now we're gonna buy the last egg piece for stage four. And let's see, what do we get? Oh, we got Blip the Porpoise. Provide you with info. Okay. And keeps your fish fed. Okay, I'm gonna say I'm not gonna use that. I don't even need gumbo, really. Let's see. What I need. I still need Rufus. I'm gonna keep Nico. And then. Since I've actually decided that, you know, it is just better to do the Guppy Crunchers and the Beetle Munchers, I'm also going to stick with, let's see, um, you know what, I'll stick with, oh, you know what, why not Prego? But yeah, so um, I will skip ahead to when I buy the next egg because the gameplay of this isn't really the best thing so yeah I'll see you then so one thing I thought I might show you is the feeding of all of these guppy crunchers so you just buy a bunch of guppies you throw one piece of food down here and then the, en <laughs> the entire cloud of guppies just gets eaten now I did buy too many but you know whatever This actually is pretty sustainable, although I st do still really hate this, but yeah, so I think now I'm starting to, you know, produce enough money to start buying some eggs, so I think I'll actually just let you guys watch the rest of this since you haven't really seen much of this gameplay so far, other than a little bit of the first level, which wasn't really that important, and then me spawning way too many guppies and only doing guppies so yeah so I bought one egg piece and so it's like this isn't my favorite tank but you know it's more manageable than I thought it would be but yeah so see we're already up to almost being able to buy our second yeah, this guy can be in pain. Yep, that's that's why he can He can kill a lot more fish with just one shot. So now we gotta buy more of these beetle munchers if we wanna finish this before the next alien comes, I'm thinking. But we do have four. So I'm thinking we don't need to buy that many more because these pearls do give a lot of money. We honestly should be collecting more of these beetles because they're worth a lot of money and they're not really getting eaten that much, so... Yeah, we're almost done with this stage, which will be the last one of uh, this tank, which I'm glad it is. Honestly, the next tank is a lot more fun than this one, and I can't wait to play it. But yeah, it's like this one, it's just a mess with how much is going on, because you can't really just always collect these beetles, because if you don't have beetles going out, your thing's gonna die also. Yes, okay, this is the guy I was hoping to get a lot earlier. Um, He's not necessarily that useful at this point in the game anymore, but yeah, I will see you guys 
next week for the final tank of this game. Yeah, but... There we go. 1,353 shells. We're not even halfway to getting a, our first bonus pet. But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna see you guys in the next episode of Insane Aquarium where we should be finishing up the main game. And then I think from every Sunday on that point, I don't know, I think I might just, I might just do like casual challenges. I'm not sure, but. I'll see you guys next time, I guess, yeah, bye.